What's up, Viva Chat Animals? Rudy here with Red Bear Dance, and welcome to the first in a five video series all about how to create the best bachata basic that you can possibly do. This first video is just going to be an introduction and a demonstration of the three levels of basic bachata body movement that I like to teach. We're going to go over the various different parts of our bodies that we use in bachata, how we can isolate those, how we can use different exercises to drill them, and then the next three videos are going to be drilling level one, drilling level two, drilling our level three bachata. And then the final video is going to be all kinds of different variations and varieties and ways you can modify it to suit your style. Here we go. First, what's going on with these? These, well, I want you to be able to see what's going on with my shoulders. Are they level or are they tilted? That's going to be very, very important for you when you're practicing in bachata, watching yourself in the mirror. Level shoulders is going to be one of the best guidelines. Also, I got to have this. Needed some contrast. Wanted you to know who I am. I love this shirt. If you like it too, they are for sale. They're on my website, redbeardance.com. Let's get started. Our level one bachata. Here's what it looks like. Seven, eight, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Very, very stiff. It's intentionally so. We'll go into more about why and why that helps us in the next video. Now, here's level two bachata. Notice the difference. Seven, eight, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Big difference, especially low down. And we'll get into what's going on, what creates that beautiful hip action in the third video. Now, here's level three bachata. Seven, eight, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Again, big difference. Whole bunch of new stuff going on in the upper half of the body, and we'll get into that in video number four. All those will be linked in the description below. So, I'll add all three of them back to back so you can see the differences turning them on. Starting with level one, level two, level three, and then back down level two, level one. Here we go. Seven, eight, one, two, three. This is level one. Five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Level two. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five. Level three. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five. Level two. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Level one. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. So those are how the different levels look, turning on and off different parts of our body. As you might be able to guess, level three is what we're going for, and we're going to get there. We're going to build into that. So. The other thing that I'm going to introduce in this video is the three main types of our basic bachata step. So we've got our regular side to side. One, two, three, five, six, seven. We've got a forward and back. One, two, three, five, six, seven. We've got a box. One, two, three, five, six, seven. And those are going to be what we all get to do. 